YouTube, how's everybody doing? All right, so today, it's finally here. We're gonna go ahead and get rid of the ridiculous stripe that I don't like on the back of this car. All right, guys, so here's the stripe. I'm gonna get a real close up of the stripe because I want you guys to see exactly what this entails. So we've got two separate stripes. We've got one here, we've got one here. And it's, it's several different pieces. So you've got two pieces here that come up the side of the car and come on the top here. And then they split right here where the trunk, let's open it real quick, where the trunk opens. So it splits right there. So then we're gonna cut these off right here. Same thing. And then the same thing right here. So we're gonna do that. As you can see here, it's under the spoiler. But this, the whole way over, stops right here at the edge of the spoiler. So this is gonna be a lot easier. This isn't gonna be the only difficult part. So I'm gonna try and do it without taking off the spoiler, but if I have to take it off, then so be it. All right guys, so I'm gonna go over my uh, material list real quick with you guys. I've got most of it laid out right here, but I don't wanna put all of it on the back of my car. So there's two things on here that I don't have laid out, but we both, all of us know exactly where they are. So let's start here, most simple, microfiber cloth, you know, nice and good, we all know what those are. Uh, flashlight, that's just a sea shit. You, you guys have saw this, it's nice. I did a little mini review on it, I can do a full one if you all want. Spray 9, I love this shit. This is the best, you know, not for paint, but for anything else. So this, this stuff right here, uh, spoilers, any kind of plastics, anything like that, it'll clean. This we're gonna use to get the adhesive off after we get the stripes off. Great product, I've used it many times, so we'll see how that works. Instead of using a heat gun, oop. Instead of using a heat gun, we're gonna use this hair dryer. Um, heat gun works good, but hair dryer is it's kinda just a safety thing for me, and for if I ever do a customer vehicle, um, there's no fire, there's no flame, not gonna damage the paint. It's just gonna make it nice and hot. It's a lot safer and it works a lot better. So we're gonna use that. All right, so I'm gonna go over my process with you guys real quick and we can talk about that. And then I'm gonna get working on this car and get this stripe off and we'll go from there. I'm also in this video, or the next I should say, gonna show you how to put badging, aftermarket badging on your vehicle. As you see I've done here and on the other side, it's featured in this, not in this video, in one of my videos, and in uh, Andy's from Diablo Formula Racing. So we're gonna take care of that and go from there. Look how good that looks on this car. All right guys, so I've got my spray nine here and my good old cloth, and we're gonna get another one because this is brand new and clean and I wanna use it for other things with this. But uh, again, microfiber, so same shit. So we'll put that there for now. So we're gonna go ahead and just kinda Spray this down real fast. Again, nothing on the paint. Just keep it right there. Come over here. And just, let's put that there. Grab this. And kinda just wipe it in real good. Get it clean under the spoiler here. Just get all this material in there. Best way to get this done. Same thing here. So we're gonna take just part of it and come down just, just carefully on this stripe. And then over, again, staying on the stripe. Don't get this on your paint, guys. If you're gonna do this by yourself and you wanna use this product, right on, but watch paint. You can get a little bit on there, but I mean, any more than a little bit, and you might have issues with your paint. So we wanna protect that. So we've got that clean. Let's take this, put it here. Love me my Gatorade. So, uh, spray nine's on, it's been wiped down. We're gonna now start to heat things up after I fully clean the paint in between the stripe on each side of it, come down here, on the bottom, around it, this just whole fender, and the same thing on the other side. So we'll get back with you guys in a minute. Um, yeah, we'll see what happens. I'm gonna come back to you when I've got everything taken care of and the stickers are off. All right, Elide, so I'm gonna show you exactly how to use this hair dryer the right way so you don't damage your paint. So when we come in here, 
We're gonna come in here. I'm ready to get, you know, this close. Don't get much closer than this, you know. You don't wanna get crazy close and just heat it up the whole way. We're gonna do this little stripe first and then the big one second. So we're gonna heat it all up. We're just gonna do this section first. So let's put this down. Got everything here on my motorcycle. Let's put that down real quick. Come back over here. Um, so we're gonna get this first stripe down here. So from the trunk lid down to the end of the fender. Let's do that, let's take care of it. I'm gonna do that, the middle stripe, and everything over there on the other side. And then all of this. And we're gonna make the same process after we spray it down, clean the paint, and start scraping. And we're not gonna scrape just with a razor blade because I don't wanna damage the paint, but we're gonna get it done and we'll see what happens. Um, yeah, so check out my next video. It'll be when this is done. I'm gonna be much more detailed about how exactly I did it. Um, if you're stopping in for the first time, please subscribe. Go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. Thanks guys, take care.